Greetings and welcome back to the channel. My name is Henry, aka Old Dude on Steam. That was the idiot check right there. And on Discord, and we are here today to play Seven Days to Die Ravenhurst mod. It is January 19th, 19th day of the playthrough, and it is 4 a.m. So let me give you my disclaimer. I curse, I curse, I curse. I use the F word like a comma. I love colorful adjectives and harsh adult language. So if said harsh adult language is offensive to you, then frankly, I may not be the channel for you, and I bid you a good day if you don't stay. I hope you do. Fingers crossed that you do stay because I love my supporters. I love you guys. Part of the reason I do this. Please hold. Cough incoming. What a great way to start, huh? All right, so Ravenhurst, day 19. What's going on? What do we got to do? I have a lot of laundry list things to do. First off, I have no fucking weaponry to speak of. I've got that and that and that's it. Oh, and that. Um... I don't have anything else by the way of weaponry other than a baseball bat, a hope, and a dream. Um, man, we, we are not looking too good. Not looking too good at all. I don't know if you saw this, but I made the recycler, and the way it works is automatic. You put something in, and it grinds it up into its base uh, resource. I don't have any quests from the trader. Oh, I do have this. We're on to Tier 3, and I'm kind of pissed about it because, well... When I finished the Tier 2, I was hoping for something along the lines of, like, you know, maybe a mini bike bundle or something like that. No, I got a fucking helmet light bundle. I got a helmet light with 1,000, and I got the helmet light itself. I got a mining helmet with 1,000 and the helmet light itself. That is shitty. Now, I would say that's a mod thing, but it's not, because I've been watching some other content creators, and when they hit a certain milestone with the quests, like Tier 1, Tier 2, uh, that bundle pops up for them as well. So, I know it's an RNG thing, but still, a fucking Helmet Light mod bundle, come on. But, I guess on the bright side, it's one less thing I'd have to worry about pulling out of the creative menu. Oh, great figures I step outside to do something and foggy 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 uh, okay um well here good news food is absolutely taken care of I have enough fried bacon to last well into not very long um, I also have drink let's check and see what we've got going on up here as far as the farm goes are you kidding me Wow fertilize seed that's growing that's growing Okay, fertilized seed, fertilized seed, fertilized seed. We're gonna keep. We're gonna leave that because it looks like it's actually all growing, but I don't think it's done yet. So we'll just leave it all be. But that's looking pretty good. Oh, that's fantastic. So we have drink, we have we have food, and soon we'll have uh, veggies. You know. Uh, let's put this away. Nope, wrong box. Bag, put that over there. Yeah, okay. I've been playing Joke Mod a lot lately, and I'm having a lot of fun. As a matter of fact, I started a new series for Joke Mod, and uh, we'll see how that goes. For now, let's see. Let's go ahead to the trader, and we'll pick up a Tier 3. I'm looking for a fetch. Maybe a clear, because, wow, this fog is fucking terrible. I need to get into some houses. <clears throat> the theory of the the... Savage Country failed us miserably. But at the same time, I haven't given up hope on getting the backpack extensions out of, say, you know, uh, houses and whatnot. But with only two days before Horde Night 3, uh, I think my focus should be on trying to get if some you weaponry. Have any jobs? Selection of medicine in Tier the 3 fetch, Mama Pizza. You know what? That's the only one. That's the one we're going to do. I'm definitely not doing that restore shit at night. And I have, every time I've tried to do an infested clear, I've got my ass handed to me. So, yeah, here we go. Oh, savage country, seriously? You, need some you know what? There we I go. Need, maybe we can get back in there you. and, uh, maybe, just maybe, we can get some backpack extensions as we're doing Quest for Jen. Oh, you know, the thing I should really be doing is looking for passing gas and trying to get those taken care of so I can make the mini bike. But, like I said, I need, I need weaponry for the Horde Knight. Uh, I mean, we're going to basically be doing the same thing we did last time because I don't have any fucking weaponry. And hopefully Trader Jen hooks us up with something. Now, I can make, I think I can, is that a snake? Are you, or is that a snake? 
Come on. I could use some food. Yep, there you are. Yep. Wow, 28 health on a snake. That's a lot. It's like super snake. Alright, so yeah. Nope. Woo -hoo, that was... I almost whacked my own bike. I'm hoping the fog clears by the time we get up to the, the pass... or the savage country. So yeah, I've been playing Joke Mod, and I've been watching a lot of content on it, and uh, like I said, I started a series on it. Um, I think it's fun. It, it's a, it's a definitely a fun take on Seven Days to Die. Um, definitely not the usual. But uh, I'm enjoying it. Yep, Savage Country. Okay, this is going to take the better part of the day to clear and loot, because once again, you know, it takes forever to loot in Ravenhurst, so this is probably going to be our day. Which is fine. I mean, you know, testing a theory part two, I guess you could call it. Uh, have I looted this? Yeah, I did. Okay, let's just clear the riffraff around. I did bring a repair kit for the baseball bat because the baseball bat is absolutely going to break by the time we get all of this cleared out without question. Especially having to clear around first. Yeah. But yeah, this is probably going to be our day. The tier threes take a while in Ravenhurst because, well, they're tier threes and looting. Oh, yeah, the weather. The weather changed, all right. Asking ye shall receive, unfortunately. Great. Well, hey, at least we've got the helmet light now and it's not going to be dark inside. I mean, it's still going to be dark inside, but we'll be able to see. So. How many arrows do I have? 57. Okay, so we can sneaky sneaky. Yep, we can sneaky sneaky some of this. Let me go loot the truck on the side. Yeah, all those clothing racks. Mm, not a truck on the side. Okay, all those clothing racks have reset. So we can literally try and see about getting um, maybe a backpack extension while we're doing this. Really? Well, come on, buddy. I got a baseball bat for you. Whoa, hey, you're supposed to fall down at that point. Someone that's not part of the POI is getting involved. Oh, no. Okay, he is part of the POI. I'll take that. Now you can come on out, stupid. Killing the zombies isn't going to be the hard part. The hard part's going to be actually looting again. Because as you saw last time, it takes a while to fucking loot in Ravenhurst, man. I don't know why that is. Why he made it so long to loot. But, yeah. You see, it's... it's. Oh, hey. Yeah, we'll definitely use that. It takes forever to loot in Ravenhurst. I think it's like double the normal time. Which, once again, I'm okay with it. I love the mod. I just don't understand why it has to take so long. What the hell was that? Oh, Colonel Clink and Jiggly Tits. Okay, well. Oh, two Colonel Clinks. Twin Colonels, yeah. Jiggly Tits. <laughs> Deals. Deals on baseball bats to the gourd. Okay. Quiet, quiet. Alright, quiet. You know what? Let's top off on some food and drink. <sighs> it's gonna drain so much. But you know what? I'm gonna use this for water as well. Actually, you know what? Let's just do that right now. That way I don't lose out on so much. Uh, the wellness buff is back, so got that going on. Yeah, I don't mind doing stuff like this again. Especially if... Uh, oh, nice, but I would really like a vehicle book, please. Vehicle, vehicle, vehicle. Yeah, I don't mind looting things like this again, because I'm still convinced that I'm going to get what I need as far as extensions go here. Thought I heard somebody outside. I mean, I hope so. I mean, it, it only makes sense to me, you know, and without going in and doing something that I don't know how to do, which is 
looking at XML files and figuring out what's what, this is the best way for me to, to do my science experiment. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, so hopefully we can find what we're looking for here. I'm going to get an awful lot of cloth again. So, yeah. All right. I keep hearing shit, man, and I... Aha! I wasn't hallucinating that time. Thought I heard somebody walk in. Where are you? Oh, it's Jiggly Tits. No, they're not open for business. It's not even 8 a.m. Alright, so. Back in we go. And you know what? I think I found a contender for fucking Ravenhurst. Are you. Uh, is that Olive? You know what? Let's just kill her to be sure, because she's going to come a little too close. Or I could miss. Whoa. Who the hell? I hit him all the way out there. Mr. Businessman. Oh, and he's feral. Okay, great. Groovy. Come on. I'm ready for you. It ain't like last time where I don't have a weapon to handle you. Yeah, last time the feral came at me, I had nothing that was capable of dealing with him. Oh, so as I was saying, I think I finally found the contender for Ravenhurst as far as zombie spawns go, because let me tell you, man, Joke Mod has an assload of them constantly. It's like, no matter what you do, they just keep coming. And I, I like the XP, but it gets a little fucking obnoxious, man. But, like I said, I like it, I'm enjoying it, the sense of humor is right up my alley. So we'll keep playing, and we'll keep the series going alongside this. Come on, backpack extension. I got my fingers crossed, man. I really do hope that this is a spot to get them. Otherwise, I'm going to have to start running houses, which, you know, I don't have a problem doing that, but if I'm all, if all I'm trying to do is just run them for backpack extensions, I don't want to be running, like, Tier 3 houses to try to get this done. Tier 2s I'm okay with, and I suppose I could take quests. Let me see, am I wearing BDU top and bottom? top and bottom. Yeah, I suppose I could take um, tier 2 quests from, from the trader to make it happen. But, oh, that's right, yeah, I'm not nearly as long a queue. But, oh, I was going somewhere with it and completely lost my train of thought. <laughs> I'm sorry. God, please tell me. Yeah, alright. I just have to do idiot checks from time to time. It's a lot of cloth, man, for a shirt. But, you know what? I'll take it because the amount I'm going to need for duct tape is like five times now. Ten times, actually. Alright, and then I don't think I'm going to worry about the... Well, I sit here and tell myself I'm not going to worry about looting certain things and then I fucking turn around and do it anyway because, well, you never know. It's Ravenhurst, man. You never know what you're going to need to loot. So pick it all up. You're going to possibly use it at some point. Oh, I can't. So, what do they sell for? 13, they're gone. Wait, what am I wearing on my feet? Oh, okay. I'm wearing armor. I really shouldn't be looting this stuff. Oh, hang on. Nope, okay. Once again, I get paranoid when I start playing this mod because shit just creeps up on you out of nowhere. Oh, and I'm very fidgety today. The last couple days were pretty crappy here in Florida, and the weather's actually cleared up nicely, and it's fucking beautiful outside. I, I don't go out. I, I, I don't go out. My wife and I are talking about going out tomorrow, which will be Saturday, but as far as, you know, going out normally, psh, fuck that. I, I avoid going out if and when at all possible. I'm a homebody. You know, I, I've, earned, I've earned my right to be a homebody, too. You know, I'm going to be 50 fucking three this year. I, I've earned my, uh, stay home and do nothing, right? <laughs> did a lot of partying in my youth. I mean, I grew up in New Jersey. That's what we did. I I had a barbed wire on this baseball bat. You both dead? You both dead? Good. But yeah, I, I did a lot of partying, so, you know, I fucking, eh, screw that. I don't have my right to stay home. Uh, we will use you. 
And I'm going to use that because it's water as well. We will take you only because, well, 94. Yeah. Who cares? Uh, I got a scrappy. Am I wearing? Yeah, okay. So we can scrappy, scrappy. We don't need that. <laughs> Please give me one or two backpack extensions. Who knows? Maybe she'll give me something good for a quest reward. <clears throat> Like, if she offers up a, a, a crafting book box, yeah, I'm taking that shit. I have had next to no luck finding the crafting books I need, and I need... Well, the main thing I need right now are just vehicle books. I have everything I got. I, I need to make a mini bike, but the skill to do it. So that's what I'm hoping for. Get a crafting box, get some, some books for making mini bikes, and away we go. How far into that am I? Just out of curiosity. Yeah, Henry, you're doing shit. No. Crafting books. Vehicles. Oh, I am four away. No, 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 no. Don't think you're going to come in here and not get shot. Yeah, no, 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 no. Not while I'm in here looting. No, 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 no. Stupid deer. Really? Chicken too? Oh, uh, you know what? I have to fix this right now. Otherwise, it's going to break, and then I will cry. Get off my fucking deer. I'll even make it easier. You see that shit? He came out of his way. Or he went out of his way to get my deer. No bueno, douchebag. Oh, and there's another deer. I don't know why I'm out here looting. I need to be inside clearing shit. Seven areas left. <clears throat> so yeah, I never went and got the airdrops. I don't think I did. Nope, I did. I got that. I can remove that. I should have removed it when I was out there. It was up on the hill. And boy, let me tell you what a pain in the ass that was. Because the zombies, they, they don't care if you're on a hill or not when it spawns in. And I, I literally had them chasing me around. I'm jumping up and down hills and trying to avoid them as best I can. They don't give a shit. They just keep coming. Alright, let's get over here and start looting all this stuff. Yeah, that's right. Run away, dear. It's your lucky day. I don't want to go back outside. I had a whole bunch of things I wanted to talk about, and I completely forgot fucking all of it. It's going to be one of those days. Uh, what am I wearing? Oh, I'm, I think I'm wearing, I'm wearing all scrap. Yes, yeah, so we can scrap you, scrap you. Look at all the cloth I'm getting. Like you said, I'm going to need it all, man. Start making duct tape, and it's going to go fast. I'm going to have to grow a goddamn field of fucking cotton plants just to keep up with my production for explosives. Although, I don't know if I'm going to be able to in this version. Once I can make, um... Once I can make glass jars, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. The problem is, is that is... The, in, in Ravenhurst, you cannot make glass jars until you can produce a blacksmith's forge. And the blacksmith forge in this, I think, is going to be, like, up around... Uh, let's see... The blacksmith for... <sighs> Damn it, I'm trying to talk to people here, dude. And you gotta come being all growly growly. Yo. Now, where was I? Oh yeah, the blacksmith forge. That is... Oh, it's only 80. Okay, that's not that bad. <clears throat> I thought it was 100. Uh, I know the lathe is 100. And the lathe allows you to craft gun parts, which, absolute necessity. Wow, whoa, whoa. Uh, okay, we'll take all that. Hey, Henry, you're encumbered. Welcome to Ravenhurst. So, yeah, um, the blacksmith forge is what you use to make glass jars, and you can't make them until then. I'm finding them. Oh, come on, dude. Seriously? Yep, he just heard me. I don't understand how he was able to hear me. But, uh, I don't do the code. I mean, I can understand... Uh, I guess it's all open. 
like one thing uh, uh, watching Kane play joke mod man oh man I, I talked about this in, in my my joke mod I was watching the poor guy play and he was in the wasteland and the number of spawns in the wasteland is astronomical I couldn't believe how many were coming out and they just kept coming you know he would kill them and more would come out it was it was fucking ridiculous how many zombies just kept coming and I mean you know you do a crack a book building and there's a lot of zombies in there no backpack extension yet but it just seemed like the more he killed the more kept coming and i'd, I'd have bailed man uh, i give him credit for his perseverance i'd have fucking bailed on that shit it was it was pretty ridiculous <sighs> you know what we're gonna loot it all it's not like i won't use the materials at some point the leather the the cloth i'll, I'll use it all i'm sure it's just going to take a while to do. Uh, I wish there was a way to reduce the loot time in Ravenhurst. I don't think there is. I don't think there's a perk that you can pick that'll... Maybe Lucky Looter? Let's check that real quick since I have a moment. Lucky. No? No? Oh, wait. Lucky Looter. Uh, looting is 10% faster. Oh, okay. Well, then I think we're going to start pumping points into that because, yeah, okay, that'll be, yeah, that's something to definitely do. I didn't, I, man, all this time I've been playing Ravenhurst and I never even fucking considered that shit. Oh, Henry, you're supposed to be helping people play this fucking game, not being detrimental. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Take Lucky Looter if you want to loot faster in Ravenhurst. I can't scrap those, so... That'll help your looting. Oh, man. You can get that down to three seconds if you put all five points into it. Come on, backpack extension. Uh, so much cloth. Now, I literally just did this POI on the last run through last episode, and I don't remember... I don't remember it at all. <laughs> How bad is that? Um, I don't even have anything to be really informative about on this episode because we're doing the same shit we did in the last one. I'm really hoping it's worth it, like what she gives me for quest reward. Molotovs, pipe bombs, anything, man. Anything that'll help for Horde Night. I'm going to rebuild the, the wall on the back of the pit. It's the only thing I can think to do at the high school. I would love to be able to build my own horde base, but man, the amount of resources I'd need to do it the way I want to do it, I, I don't have, A, I don't have the time, B, I don't have the resources, and in order to collect the resources, it would just it would take forever. So, I have literally now got one entire, I think this is going to fill up the entire trash bag full of cloth. And as you can see, I'm spending most of my time looting as opposed to clearing. So, definitely lucky looter, worth it, just for the looting speed. You know what? I don't care. I know it's iron, but I don't care. Oh, I would love to, you know what? Don't care. I really do not wish to be this encumbered. Uh, we can get rid of that. Uh, I think I have iron underground. I'm not positive. No, I don't think I do yet. I know I hit bedrock, but I don't remember if I actually have an iron vein here. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Damn it. I wish we were. Use your words, Henry. Use your fucking words. I think if I have time after I get done doing this, we'll go do the airdrop and see what we get out of that. Because it's on our way to Trader Jet. Well, it's just past Trader Jet, so we can go turn this in and then hit that. And that's probably going to be the bulk of the day. Yeah. 
Yeah, and I know this probably seems really boring, and I do apologize, but like I said, I'm looking for something, and I'm kind of desperate. Eh, I'm not really desperate. It would be nice to find one in here, though, so that way at least, you know, I have a, a benchmark or something. I hear you. Well, let's go deal with it. Where are you? Oh, you're over there. Oh, okay. Well, if they're not in the parking lot, I'm not going after them. <clears throat> I thought they were coming this way. That's why I was stopping to go get them. All right, I got all that looted. All right, so yeah, more cloth, more cloth, more cloth. And I honestly don't know if this is even going to be enough. I mean, like I said, if I start making explosives, explosive arrows, crossbow bolts, whatever, I don't, I don't know if I can make them now, but when I can, um, I'm going to go through that fucking cloth fast. So this will all be used, I promise you. Might be a matter of time, but it will all be used. All right, is that it? That's it for all of that. All right, and then let's get the front, and then we'll do the side. Oh, I still have more racks over there to my left, to my right. I don't know if I'm going to use a shotgun this time around. I don't think I'm going to. Stupid deer again. Come on, good recipe. Good recipe. Well, I need I need everything, but you know, vehicles are definitely the priority. What I was originally going to do, uh, can we modify? I don't think we can modify that. No, this isn't. I'll tell you what, man, joke mod. You can modify rank ones. That's that's so out of the norm for me. Oh, look at all that crap. <laughs> I'm so encumbered. And all I'm really hoping for is just a... Oh, no, we're not we're not messing around with that crap. That's that's getting... Let me go put some stuff in the bike. I'm rambling, and I apologize, guys. I know I am a rambling buffoon today. I'm hyped up on coffee. I came home from work. I didn't bother sleeping. So I literally am just... I'm just chugging coffee today. Uh, yeah, okay, that's good. And we're back to running form. All right. So where were we over here? God, I thought I cleared more of this. This is going to take, like I said, this is going to take all day. So we're going to try to get through this as fast as possible. Well, at least I don't have to worry about any of these racks in the back. These things, I can't believe how long these things take. I am... The difference between mods is unbelievable. Like, I'm running around in joke mod. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm, And I know I keep talking about it, and I'm sorry, but I'm running around, and I'm doing stuff, and I hear the zombie here and there, but it doesn't stop me in my tracks like it does in Ravenhurst. Ravenhurst scares the hell out of me on a regular basis. I don't have... I mean, Darkness Falls has done that, but Ravenhurst just is the pinnacle of fucking terrifying for me in, in seven days. I don't know why. It's no different than any other mod, really. I mean, I know it's more difficult, but... It's, I don't know why it's just more goddamn terrifying. I'm not going to have time to get the airdrop. We're going to finish this up and have to get the hell out of here and go home. <clears throat> I feel like I've stepped into a time loop. As a matter of fact, that's probably what we'll name the episode, Time Loop. <sighs> this is, this is, come on, give me one, just one, so I know that at least this is a spot to get them. I don't, at this point, I'm starting to think not, and I don't understand why. This would, this makes the most sense to me. Pack, pack, extension, clothing. But what do I know? And I know I'm scrapping the paint too. I don't care. I don't use paint for anything really. I don't think there's even a recipe for it aside from, um, I don't know. 
maybe there's a recipe for it. I'd have to get some in check. I don't think there is. But hey, it's Ravenhurst, you never know. God, this takes forever. At least I'm getting XP for looting, too. Wrong key, Henry. Well, like I said, the looting is what's taking the longest. Clearing is going to take no time at all. Oddly enough. Alright, let's do this. Let's get to the fucking clearing. Anybody home? Come on. Yep, I knew you were coming, Colonel Clink. Anybody else? No, just this guy? Good. Yep, alright. Let's just fucking take him off the hinges. Just in case. Nah, I don't think anybody else is coming, but you never know. Uh, I don't I don't need that. Wait, how much does it sell for? Uh, yeah, we'll keep it. Only because I'll sell it. If it sold for less than what it did, I would I would get rid of it, but 38's not bad. Where the hell are you? You're not part of this. Thick. Part of the POI. I hate when zombies come in from outside. I'm just trying to do the POI like a normal human being. Stay the fuck away. Did he fall out of the ceiling? I didn't think there was anything in the ceiling here. Okay, that's locked. I'm not worried about looting these shelves or anything else right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Oh. What is it with the Colonel Clinks in the bathroom? Ow. Hey, you're not supposed to run. Out of stamina. Okay, one dead. We'll just gingerly walk away from Colonel Clink. Well, Colonel Lynch, sorry. Now, somebody's coming in from outside, I think. Yeah, not part of the POI, I hear him. Do I have a steroid? I do. There we go. We're not encumbered anymore. We're going to have to use two of these, I think, to keep it up. Yeah. But we're not encumbered anymore, and I'll take it. Where is that coming from? Right here. Ah, steroids. Who says they don't help you hit home runs? I just home runned his head. Yes, I said home run. I just home runned his head into next year. I'm going to have to make a new baseball bat, which is going to make me very sad. But this one has served me very well. Now that I am steroided up for the next 12 minutes, I'm not going to worry about what I pick up and what I don't pick up. Alright, this, this is the unlocked way. Alright, come on. How many we got? What do we got? Uh, one, two, three, four, five. It looks like six. Five. Four. That fucking lead. Stumble forward, crap, man. That is such garbage. Oh, great. I wasted a swing on, on a shelf. <sighs> yeah, that that I really don't get, man. You hit somebody and they stumble forward. How stupid is that? I know I've bitched about it before, and I'm not going to bitch about it again. I'm already bitching about it again. I'm sorry. It just doesn't make any sense to me. I don't, I don't get it. And I know that's not a Ravenhurst thing. That is a seven days to die thing. Because I've seen it in pretty much every mod for content that I've been watching. You know what? There should be some cash in here that I can take. Yep. Alright, don't worry Nurse Nancy. I'm coming for you. You might actually be the last one. Yep, she was it. Alright, good deal. And... Yeah, 
I'm not getting through that. Okay, so that took a bit longer than I thought it would, but only because I looted everything. I could have very easily bypassed a lot of this crap and just moved on, which I probably should have, but like I said, I'm trying to get backpack extensions, and I thought this would be a great place to do it. You know, the science experiment... Really? Baseball bat quality three? Oh, how, how, how good can we make it now? Baseball bat. Nice! Okay, so we're up over 100, which means I can repair it one time when I make it. That's bueno. Alright, and... I wish I could get into that lockbox, but... Wait, do I have a lockpick? No. So, yeah, that's not going to happen. Alright, what is that? Hey, there's a backpack extension. So, maybe I'm not too far off base with the Savage Country? I mean, second run through, and we got one. And it's in a Savage Country box. Oh, oh damn it, why couldn't you be better quality? Woodbow quality too. Why couldn't you be like over a hundred so I could at least repair you one time? That would have been awesome. Uh, but hey, we know, we know, we know Savage Country boxes can give us backpack extensions now, which was something I did not know. I was very, very unawares of that. So that's good. We're going to use that right now because I'm down just a little bit and I don't like being down at all. I'm going to hold on to this backpack uh, mod until, or backpack extension until I get home. And I'm not going up on the roof. We're done. Um, until I get home and I see what happens or what I look like when the steroids were off. Um, but yeah, hey, Savage Country boxes. We at least proved a little bit of our theory that you can get them in Savage Country. So, two run-throughs, one backpack extension. Honestly, at this point, I would call that a victory only because I know we're getting them. You know, it's it's not like it was in Ravenhurst 8.6 or 7 or whatever it was, where I didn't get one for almost 50 levels. You know, and I wound up pulling, pulling out the entire inventory slot spots out of the creative menu, you know? And on the, the previous series that I was doing, I was like level 27 or 28 when I finally did it. You know, it got, it got frustrating, always being encumbered and not, you know, seeing any return on my time investment in the form of backpack extensions. But here, I've gotten five or six already. You know what? Just because you ran your fucking mouth, lady. No one likes a busybody. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that your sister? Well, she should have kept her fucking pie hole shut then, huh? Oh. Oh, you're a tier one. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I thought she was a runner because of the different color in her eyeball and mouth, but yeah, she's a tier one. Great. So now I'm starting to see tier ones out in the wild. They're not just coming with the horde. And I'm level 15. Okay. That's going to be problematic, I'm sure. Oh, I'll live. Shut up. All right, so yeah, we are. Mm, let's see how far away from the airdrop am are we? We m probably will have time to go do that, and that's going to be the last thing we do. I'm gonna have to kill him though because he's gonna keep coming, and I do not wish him to keep coming. Come here, yo. What in the fuck was that? See what I mean? They shouldn't come forward when you hit them. That's what should happen. Sit the fuck down. I need more coffee. No, actually, coffee's probably the last fucking thing I need right yes. now. Now that you have some money to spend, oh, are you a kidding me? Sale for the rest of no, the day. I need this more. I need this more. How many jobs? Infested, clear, bury, fetch. We'll, we'll do the I've fetch. This is dangerous work. I can, I can blast that out tomorrow really quickly. All right, so we're gonna go get the the airdrop, and then that head back to base, and that's gonna be it. But before we do that, 
Oh, please vehicle, please vehicle. Oh, no vehicle. Damn it. And I didn't sell anything to Trader Jen, which, hey, fortunately she's got multiple entries, so I'm going to do that right now. Oh, no vehicle. Damn it. We'll get there. I know we will. Hey, Jen, I'm back. I missed your discounts. Uh... Yep, I hear you. You brighten my day. How you brighten mine? I can help you. Your discounts are amazing. Two best discounts in all the wasteland. I was talking to Trader Jen, Darlene. Piss off. I was talking about her discounts. <laughs> I'm an ass. <laughs> I still have to wonder, though, if she's fashioned after somebody that, that the developers know in real life. I, I will always wonder that, because it just seems like that could be the case. How did I not loot this already? And, okay, I got four minutes and 35 seconds. That should be enough time. And I'm, I'm talking about on the steroids. That should be enough time to get out there, kill the zombos, and grab the... Oh, my God, words. Grab the airdrop, yeah. Yeah, 400 meters. And then, like I said, once the airdrop is obtained, we'll take it back to base and call it a day. And I will do day 20 off camera. I'm going to bang out that retrieve the supplies and I'm going to hit some, some um, passing gas, any passing gas that I can find to try to get books. Um, like I said, we're four off and then I can make a mini bike. And once I can make a mini bike, uh, as we all know, the game takes on a whole new meaning because transportation is bueno. So that'll be good. That'll be good. Please don't let the weather change on me. I don't honest. I I don't know if Jax has done this himself or if it's a a vanilla thing. But the weather seems to change more in Ravenhurst than in any other mod. And like I said, I don't know if that's done by design or if that's just a fucking shitty vanilla thing. But man, I'll tell you what. When playing other mods in comparison, Ravenhurst definitely has way more weather events than any other mod that I've played. All right, let's park the bike up over here. Let's get our stamina back. Pull out the old, we're going to choppy choppy this. We're going to leave these trees as something to run around. And we're going to pop one of these for some stamina regen. And go. Here they come. Wow. Oh, these are fucking tier twos. Oh, that's so not good. And time to move. You're not part of this, lady. Stay back. Are you part of it? Yep, you are. Look at them all. God, my kingdom for a Molotov cocktail. By the way, little fun fact, if you chuck a Molotov cocktail at the supply box, you will set it on fire and it will disappear on you. Please go away. Yeah, I, I did that. I set I set one on fire and uh, yeah, it, it fucking disappeared on me. I was so pissed. Oh, out of stamina. We'll just walk away. Okay, is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Okay. What are you crawling for, dude? Run away. Now, once again, I, I know I've done one or two of these on camera. If you walk away from the area of this, they are going to respawn. So you have to stay within a certain area or a certain diameter of the supply drop or they will respawn. I've had it happen. It sucks. Oh, that sucks too. And they can destroy the box, because I've had them do it before. It takes them a while, and it doesn't happen very often, but hey, I have had them do that. All right, you know what? Oh, we got a blue runner incoming. 
See that fucking lunge forward, man. She got hit in the pie hole and she came forward. That's that's stupid. Okay, he fell down. Alright, you're gonna Come on. Okay. Let's go over here. I should be able to swing and a miss. Alright, she's dead. We got these two and stupid Lieutenant Dan. Oh nice, thank you. Not so stupid anymore, dude. Oh, 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 oh. Nope, stay within the area. Okay, so they're both almost dead. So, alright. Not bad, not bad. We took one ding. So, we'll live with that. Because we're alive and they're not. And now the crickets are starting. So, let's get this. Then we'll loot that bag that Lieutenant Dan dropped. And we'll get the fuck out of here, man. So, yeah, as you can see, airdrops are very, very dangerous. Nice. That was so worth coming to do. And I am not being sarcastic. That was absolutely worth it. Now, if that box, I open it up and it's got... No. I was hoping it had vehicles in it, but we'll take it. Uh, grilled meats. Nice. Grilled meats is much better than that shit. Uh, use. I'm going to use a couple of these. Okay, now that the backpack is... We'll read that. Accept. And... Oh, that, that opened three slots? Oh, sweet. That's fantastic. All right. So, yeah, like I said, we're finding the extensions. They are, they are dropping for us. So it's not, you know, unheard of. And the Savage Country, I mean... Yeah, we didn't get one the first time around, but we got one the second time around, so at least I know I can go to a savage country and possibly get one. Uh, the other thing I need to do is I need to find a hotel. I don't care what size it is. If it's the Tier 4 hotel, that'll take me like two days to run. I'll do it, because there are nightstands and closets and all kinds of shit in there that, that I can open up to possibly get what I need as far as backpack extensions. Like I said, we're finding them, so I'm, I'm, I, I don't know if you can hear the excitement in my voice because we're actually finding them, but they're there. They're in-game now. It's a thing. It's not, you know, an unbalanced issue anymore like it was. You know, we're, we're good on that. So, like I said, day 20, I'm going to do... Uh, I'm going to do this this fetch, which I know is going to be right in downtown. And then I'm going to see if I can't hit a passing gas for some books, hopefully. Oh, he's a runner. And uh, with any luck, we'll be able to craft a mini bike. Now, if I have the mini bike next episode, I'll show you the books. Um, and once again, believe me, I am extremely tempted to pull shit out of the creative menu because this is so fucking hard, comparatively speaking. But no, we will not be doing that. Uh, anybody else around? Yeah, we're going to have to kill one or two, I'm sure. Only because I just don't want anybody coming at me. Oh, Olive, look at, look at you and your twin sister. Jesus Christ. Don't you, you ladies need to take a fucking hint, man. Just because you're new to the neighborhood doesn't mean we want to chat. Like I said, talking to you sometimes makes me want to shit. Hit you in the dupe. Dupe, dupe, yeah. Alright. Anybody else? I don't think so. I should be okay. Clear the bike out. I'm going to have to repair that, too. Clear the bike out, get inside, and that's where we will call the episode. I can pick up the insects, too, if I want, and make some bug kebabs. So, anyway, like I said, we know we know now that we're getting them, and it's, it's going to happen. The progression is slow, but we'll get there. Um, I'm, I'm okay with that. And I, I really am. I mean, seriously, I'm okay with slow progression. It's part of Ravenhurst. It's the magic of it. Um, it's one of the things I like about it is, is you can't just fucking advance. You know, I'm snapping my fingers. I don't know if you can hear it, but you can't just advance really quickly. It takes time. And I'm good with that. So if you like the content, please like, join, and subscribe. Tell your folks, tell your friends, tell your families. Be sure to hit that bell notification icon so you can be alerted to our latest or 
yeah, our latest playthroughs for what's going on. We've got Joke Mod starting up, and now we've got it running side by side with Ravenhurst. And hopefully, um, we'll get Darkness Falls or Age of Oblivion going soon, and then we'll have all three going at the same time. I'm trying to work with Norbert, our good buddy Norbert, to see if he wants to do Age of Oblivion together. It would be a duo series, but we'll see how that goes. So, anyway, until next time, thank you very much for watching. I very much appreciate it. Make sure you and your take care of you and yours. Make sure everybody's safe and healthy. And until next time, go play your game. Take care.